I'm Jen Kane. And I'm Pat Jansen. When asked about Bob Woodward's new book that disparages Donald Trump, Sarah Huckabee Sanders <coughs> joked that she'll read it because she likes fiction. Her favorite piece of current fiction is the latest White House press briefing. <laughs> <laughs> Protesters have been showing up outside Brett Kavanaugh's Senate hearing dressed up like handmaids. So his hearing is kind of like Comic-Con, but with even more fear of vagina. <laughs> <laughs> They're terrifying. <laughs> The Trump administration announced a new rule Thursday that would allow immigrant children to be detained indefinitely, added an ICE spokesperson. The Trump administration will release any child who says her name is Tiffany. <laughs> In an interview Wednesday, President Trump claimed that he has 100 pictures of James Comey and Robert Mueller hugging and kissing each other. And zero pictures of him and Melania doing the same. <laughs> I want the former. <laughs> President, Trump has canceled pay President Trump has canceled pay raises for federal employees saying the nation's budget can't afford it. Responded a federal employee. So I guess if I want a pay raise, I'll need to have an affair with President Trump and then get Michael Cohen to pay me some of that sweet hush money. <laughs> <laughs> President Trump decided not to golf on Labor Day. He wanted to treat it like a holiday and not a regular work day. <laughs> and now, where hard news meets North Hollywood, here with the entertainment news is NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell. I'm Roger Goodell, Commissioner of the NFL, a.k.a. the Ginger Hammer, a.k.a. the Pharaoh of Football, a.k.a. God of the Men, which includes all of you guys! <laughs> now I'm actually you're lucky to be here. I'm skipping my fifth workout today. So let's do some jokes. I keep me here next to my jack pectoral. In between, though, I might do some power lunges or some other workout things, you know, just to keep fit. <laughs> You two had to cancel a concert in Berlin last Saturday night after Bono suffered a complete loss of voice. Doctors then had to convince Bono that he couldn't heal himself immediately by laying his hands on his own throat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. One more. <laughs> The ruby slippers that Judy Garland wore in The Wizard of Oz have been discovered after being stolen from a Minnesota museum 13 years ago. They were returned by an angry Republican who was worried they might be Nikes! Oh! <laughs> Nikes are the uh, a provider of uniforms for the NFL, so please buy their stock! Oh! <laughs> to celebrate, the 25th anniversary of The X-Files. Mattel is releasing Mulder and Scully Barbie dolls. The dolls will investigate the mystery of what happened to their genitals. Not like me! Fire oh, right here! And finally, NBC has ordered a new Law and Order series that will focus on hate crimes. So dust off that resume, Roseanne! Yeah! Ah, <laughs> oh, thank you so much! <laughs> thank you, NFL Commissioner uh, Roger Goodell. There we go. I about said Paul Tagliabue. Uh, <laughs> Uh, Rotten Tomatoes has announced changes designed to increase the diversity of the voices on its website. Explain to spokesperson for Rotten Tomatoes. As an example of these more diverse voices, we brought in the only critic that actually enjoyed the Happy Time murders. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a Senate office building may be named after John McCain. Mainly so senators can have a place to work where they know President Trump will never be invited. <laughs> A spokesperson for the Chinese government said last Thursday that the U.S. is first in the world when it comes to twisting the truth. Hey, we're actually beating China at something. <laughs> the USDA has found evidence of mad cow disease in, in, in an animal in Florida, and evidence of mad people disease in everyone who lives in Florida. <laughs> 
Suck it, Florida. <laughs> Detroit, Detroit Tigers TV announcers Mario Impemba and Rod Allen got into a physical altercation after a game and have been suspended for the rest of the season. However, the league may punish them further by making them go back to announcing for the Detroit Tigers. <laughs> An isolated Amazon tribe with no known contact with the outside world was spotted by a drone flying over the Brazilian jungle. They're so far removed from modern society, they're only just now getting to Breaking Bad. <laughs> I hope they don't spoil it for me. They flew through Lost. <laughs> Amway co-founder Richard DeVos died Thursday at age 92. Mourners are invited to attend his funeral, but only if they can sell 10 tickets to the funeral to their friends. <laughs> In Texas last Friday, a truck carrying Axe body spray caught fire and exploded which explains why last Friday, Texas smelled like New Jersey. 